I wanted to go over a few of the fundamentals of receiving uh, digital TV uh, really well and the difference between rabbit ears and an external directional antenna like an attic antenna or an outdoor antenna and show a few of the different uh, parameters are affected by the different antennas and we'll go over a couple different converter boxes the typical apex box and then this is a, a little $35 box I picked up at the ham fest um, that actually will record the USB and we'll, we're going to be going over two different antennas just your typical rabbit ears and also a uh, American made wine guard HD 7010 so these are a decent set of rabbit ears color master um, UHF VHF rabbit ears this is a wine guard HD 7010 installed in the attic this is one of their lower gain models I really don't need anything much bigger than this in Los Angeles because all our towers are on Mount Wilson in one spot and the antenna can be in a fixed a fixed location and it doesn't need to rotate because all the transmitters are in one spot in some parts of the country you might need a a, a rotor or a motorized rotor to rotate around to get different transmitters depending on where they're located. Um, the antennas come in a variety all the way up to double this long and the longer they are the more gain they have. Okay we'll start with the rabbit ears so go ahead and explain this. We'll yeah we're looking at a Sencor it's called a digital cable analyzer it basically measures digital analog TV signals for um, the, on the digital side, two two different aspects: the power, which is the quantity of signal, and the MER, which is ma modulation error ratio, which is the quality of the signal. The digital TV relies on phase changes to the carrier, and so if you have multipath or anything like that it'll degrade your MER. This thing will measure I believe from 20 from the low 20s DB all the way up to uh, maximum of 36 is is the perfect quality signal. So right now we're looking at 8 VSB which is the modulation used on digital TV local channel 11 they broadcast on 11 which is 201 megahertz uh, symbol rate below that 5.38 mega symbols per second and um, then we have the power power old minus 8 DB MV right now and we're having trouble even measuring the signals not locking on it but once it gets a lock we can get an MER takes several seconds to calculate it doesn't look like we're going to get it. There you go. So right now, power level minus 4, MER 27 dB. Now the minimum, I believe, that we kind of work with is about 26 dB. So that's just barely above minimum signal for, the, uh, for channel 11 on the rabbit ears in here. Should we switch to the uh, attic antenna? Yeah, we'll switch. So the, the quality is barely usable right yeah, now? barely usable. As you walk around the room, it'll drop in and out and so on. Okay, we're going to pause and we'll hook up. Well, okay, you can hook that up. This is RG6 yep. coming down from the antenna. This is a good quality coax or better than 59. So off the attic antenna we got 17 dB of power. So that's a 20 dB increase. And those of you that know decibels, that's 100 times change in the uh, intensity of the power. And our MER, or quality, 34.7. So it's very good. Below that, it will measure bid error rates, 
and count them up if it detects errors but none being detected okay you want to show that haystack yeah so it also has a primitive spectrum analyzer and ideally we want to see it as flat as possible you know obviously you're not going to get that in the real world because you got multi-path and this antenna is in an attic so there might be some things interacting with it there but that's the uh, the signal channel 11 go back to the show this on the other antenna the rabbit yeah ears. there'll be a, a nine day difference and on the rabbit ears it's pretty badly distorted Look at that big you shouldn't, chunk. Yeah, you shouldn't have this notch. And you can try to adjust the antennas. But you can see I put my hand on it, it, it everything interacts with it. There's a whole big chunk missing there. That... Yeah. Okay, we're going to do a channel scan using the rabbit ears. So go ahead and we'll see how many... Seven, caught nine, eleven. I'm going by the call signs that are there. Day star. Wonder what Sky Can is. Okay, this is the, uh, the rabbit ears. Go ahead, go through some of the channels. Let's see how it works. I see some pixelation there. Oh, yeah. Downtown Inland OC day planner tomorrow. We're gonna to be below average between five to eight degrees because of the cloud. NBC's pretty good. Says the funniest person in the room. That one looks pretty good. Bobber was taking control in the first half. Quarterback Nick Marshall heads towards the corner and suddenly the Tigers are up 21-3 and number one. Did you get a count? What was the count on the channel? 77 with that antenna? Yeah, Crystal, thank you for that great question. Yeah, 
looks like we got some pixelization going on. Channel yeah. nine. Is teaching us that food can be your medicine by eating bananas. Um, let me see. Maybe. Well, actually, it doesn't. Like if you go into the program. It doesn't have the number anymore, but it was over 50 channels, I know that much. I'll have to check the video to see that. So here's one we can't get, channel 11, unless we move the antennas. In a car accident. So the news that this family actually got in a car all before Meta day. According to TMZ, Honey Boo Boo, Mama Ju, and as the fish sugar bear, he was making a left hand turn in the intersection. Guy driving a truck was allegedly speeding in the opposite direction with his lights off and crashed into them. So, what do you want to do now? Keep it with the outdoor? Yeah, outdoor. we'll compare. We'll see how many. We'll go through and scan and see how many channels we get with the outdoor antenna. This box is actually working pretty good with that. Yeah. Flash gemstone truck. Twenty is breaking up pretty bad. What that thing had nine sub channels? Go back. Yeah, Go back. Channel eighteen uh, has nine sub channels. All standard definition stuff. They're choosing you know, quantity over quality. They have a lot of different channels they want to carry. So Twenty. If one, if one stream is breaking up, then generally they're all breaking up because they're all coming off the same signal. So. This will be a great stock and a great uh, a great growth opportunity, almost regardless of what happens. Jesse? Well, there isn't. It's like any other mortgage, only with reverse. Thirty dash ninety six. Yeah, I don't know. It's just air box, whatever that is. Stars. A, okay. This is one of those subscription channel things. Because I don't know, it's not getting it. Familia, pero para un... Do right and not what. Ten streams on that one. Ten streams. Yeah, on 44. Okay, let's take a look at the other antenna. Okay, so Go ahead and do a scan again. Okay. Well, it's full stereo too. Hear it? Yeah. so it's, you would just hit channel seven. One eighty three is is the, is the first frequency. Anything below one eighty three is not used anymore here for TV.
I wonder what 48 is. It says testing. Fifty nine antenna, remember that. We gotta mm -hmm. see that might be that digital square antenna. So remember fifty nine. Seventy six channels, seventy eight channels, eighty seven channels. A hundred and two channels. This is with the attic antenna, hundred and six. 112, 120, 120. wonder what those are, I wonder what radio 1 and 2 are. And if you're anything like me, you're going to delete 90% of them. 160 channels so Once far. it's all done, you're going to just delete. That might be it. See, now we're in the 700 megahertz band, which has been given up for uh, internet, right? Yeah, wireless. Mobile phones. Yeah. So there's not anything there. So 160 channels. Yep. With the uh, over the air antenna here in LA, with the good antenna up in the attic. Delete it all. You need to bring out the best look in you. Naturally. How do you feel about your look? I really love it. Beauty comes from positivity, so toss the gun hey, crank it up. start glowing. Naturally beautiful. Next, only on Berea Living. Can't get that KIL on. Retro TV. Retro TV. That's what it says. Sino TV. Fine. Huh, same thing. Here we have a repeating situation. 64-1 and dash 3 of the same content. So. But we shouldn't have any uh, signals dropping out or pixelating anything. Unless they're very weak. Even with a with an attic antenna, uh, they should, everything should be pretty good now. So, what do we want to do, go back down to five? No, no, go up through those higher channels. Okay. I was curious to see what that one that said radio one and radio two are. Yeah, let's see. So, there's some here, zero dash zero. Go mean. back to that SD, that must, is that San Diego or standard definition? Go back. That way? Yeah. I guess the other way. Oh, there it is. That fancy uh, test pattern. Yeah, our fancy test pattern. On the 1966 Zenith combo unit. Looks good. Yeah, that looks okay. I think with over the air digital TV and all these sub channels, it's a good idea, but we just don't have enough viewers to support really quality programming on them, so they're just kind of. Most of them are. Stuff like this, you wouldn't even really want to waste your time with. Watch Remax Fine Homes Candidate Group Real Estate. Yeah, one, Marina. Quiero saber la verdad, Carmen. De Azteca, America. Entonces, so.
That sounds good. Crank that up. I kind of like that digital. Like digital problem? Yeah. Oh, yeah. What's your name? What's your name, honey? What's your name? What's your name? What's your name? What's your name, huh? Oh, that's a network. Along with everybody joining us on the World Wide Web and everybody. A limited engagement. All right. Do you want to pause it? Along with the other cancers listed. Okay, here's the lung cancer channel. Asbestos exposure. What was this one called? To asbestos Antenna, and TV. Antenna TV. So this is another like RTV type. Plaster or maintenance worker may have put you at risk. In addition, because asbestos was widely used on ships, those working in ships. This roll. What this roll for a minute? Retro TV again. Another retro TV. Well, or maybe it's the same one. John, you're not serious, are you? Very. Belinda, go and have your bath. I didn't mean to be nasty. Honest, I didn't. You never mean to be. You just are. And John, you haven't been mad at me for more than two hours in your life. LD, home. that's low power yeah, digital. Yeah, exactly. I think that's and what that is. This is, is, is channel eight, eight, low power digital. Yeah. Eight one, eight two, and it has multiple streams. She can pull probably about 475, 465, somewhere in there. Weightlifting. She's masters. She's over 40. Just... Tough TV. Tough TV. That was the oh, amazing okay. jumping emerald. More infomercial. Y'all just rolling through this. Oh, oh, what's that happening to Charles Williams? Hello, football team. Me, 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 Just barely on the cusp of receivability. Same thing again. SD on the second stream. It's a big deal. There's an awards banquet. Okay, should we show the recording feature on this box? Yeah, you need to put the disc on the uh, pen drive in. Okay, this converter box, as you can see how small it is, has a USB port on the front of it. And what you can do is you can insert just a, a stick in it. Try and do this one handed. And now what we'll do is we'll record we'll record a few seconds of this and I'll upload it. Okay, it's recording there. And then we'll uh, let it go for a minute and then I'll upload one of these files directly so you can see what it looks like. Here are the recorded files from the DTV converter box. What I'll do is I'll tack this on. I'll just upload this straight to YouTube with the rest of the video. Thanks for watching and more to come later. some people say walking takes too long uh, but i say with walking you can't go wrong uh, 